Well, with the weather warming and school out, a lot of folks want to hit the pool. But many Austin pools did not open on time. In fact, a dozen remain closed indefinitely. The problem? Not enough lifeguards. KXN's Angie Bevan was in the neighborhoods today. It's summertime. It's what you do. Gotta go swimming. Half of Austin's city pools didn't open when expected. We stopped by Givens uh, Pool, our neighborhood pool, um, and it was closed, so we decided to come here. To Bartholomew Pool, all redone, a bigger, newer aquatic center. Austin's pools were originally set to open Friday, June 6th. The day before, city officials said some wouldn't open until Monday, June 9th instead. Shite Pool, right in the middle of Hyde Park, is one of the city's pools that opened Friday the 6th. But two days later, the gates locked and these signs are up saying due to staffing, the pool is closed. Hopeful swimmers turning around. We're going to meet up with some friends and go splash in the pool. No lifeguards or staff were on duty there Sunday. It's very frustrating when you're expecting to be open. There was no warning, no sort of maybe tomorrow it's closed. Shite Pool is one of a dozen pools that will remain closed Monday, pushing a long-awaited summer. It's wonderful. I look forward to it every year opening. Back a little further. In Austin, Angie Bevan, KXAN News. A few pools will reopen tomorrow, but 12 will remain closed because of the lifeguard shortage. Another two are still closed for maintenance. The Parks and Rec Department tells us 300 lifeguard positions out of 750 still need to be filled. We've got an updated list of the open and closed schools on KXAN.com. If you're interested in becoming an Austin lifeguard, they're holding another job fair this week on Tuesday evening. You can meet Parks and Rec staff and enjoy free pizza, drinks, and dessert. 15 and 16-year-olds will need a parent present for the interview. If you're 17, you just need a parent's signature. What does it take to become an Austin lifeguard? We thought we should look into that. Before taking the class, lifeguards have to swim 300 yards continuously using three different strokes. They then have to retrieve a 10-pound object from the bottom of the pool. Lifeguards also have to tread water for two minutes using only their legs.